Hello friends, welcome to Friday Night Files and welcome to Atonis Part 2. We are starting like we started yesterday by making a cup of coffee, of course. And having a baguette. I guess we brought some pizza home from work yesterday. Hey, where's the coffee? Hello? There's still coffee in here? No, it's empty. Where did the coffee go? There it is. You psycho, why don't you put it in the same cupboard as last time? Need a cup. And here we go. Oh, I'm so excited to see what this... What this game brings. It got jump scares all over the place. And it's awesome. Let's drink the coffee. Check our emails. Another pizza night. Hey Joe, ready for another night shift at the pizzeria? And no, it's not the most thrilling thing you could be doing. It was all about keeping the family business running smoothly. Those not prepped, so you'll need to use the mixer. Orders will come in on the computer like always, and if you ever need a reminder about recipes, check out the pizza recipes on the desktop. I swing by in the morning to take over. It's going to be a straightforward night, <laughs> yeah. I bet. You got this. Later, Jimmy. Unacceptable actions. I am beyond furious about your recent actions. It's downright unacceptable. I've been your sole supporter, guiding you after your mother's incident. This is how you repay me? Is this, some, is this some misguided attempt to challenge me or display ingratitude for everything I've done for you? Your behavior is disgraceful. Reflect on it and don't think for a second that there won't be consequences. My Caldo, your best bet against financial trouble. Okay. Why are, you, why are you so angry, man? Where did the car go? Hey, cuz. Hope you're doing well. I stumbled upon something pretty cool, and I just couldn't resist sharing it with you. I'll attach a quick video for you to check out. Trust me, it's worth a watch. Take care, Jimmy. Okay, let's see the video. Oh, nice and peaceful. <laughs> Go change your shorts. I need to change my pants. And my t-shirt. Because. I've got coke all over it. You know Coca-Cola. Or. Just some kind of cola. Holy jeez, I didn't see that coming. Why didn't I see that coming, man? <laughs> okay, bad timing. Damn it. She grabbed my car keys. Yeah. <laughs> Where are the car keys? It's good that I have my casual you know, home clothes on. There is no one out there today. That's good. Now let's go to work. Room 109. That's the same room as that Annabelle. That we saw in the end of the first episode. If you haven't checked it out, check it out now. But back then, we got out from the elevator and then we turned right and left and right and left. It wasn't just straight forward. Okay, maybe it was another layout back then. Oh! Did 
Please get away from me. Hello? Oh, shit. This is spooky, man. Oh. No. Holy crap. Oh. oh, I got goosebumps and chills, man. That was spooky as... Hello? Hello? Everything seems all right. Shit. This is gonna be a good one. I can feel it. Not all ghosts are bad. Okay. Need to get to the underground garage. A sad story. Okay, let's find the underground garage. Where could it be? Underground, I guess. But how do I get underground? I don't know. Not this way, I suppose. Is it here? Is this a garage door? No? I can't sprint. That sucks. Should have a Whoa. Hello? I'm just trying to get to work here, man. Where is it? He, she taking us? A shadow creep of a child. Hello, little one. Child's memorial. Oh no, it is a sad story. Precious child. If tears could build a staircase and memories alone, I'd walk right up to heaven and bring you home again. Hello, can I, can I help you? Where are you taking me? You want to swing? Hey! Woohoo! Where are you, where are you going? Yeah, want to try to merry go around? Wee! Can we make it go faster? Hello? Where did you go? Oh, there you are. Watch light. Yay! Whee! Are you having fun? I guess it's, this is your memorial, yeah? Oh, that's sad, man. That's sad. I 
I don't know which way we are going. I think it's this way, yeah? I almost I have tears in my eyes, you know? <laughs> that, was, that was pretty awesome, man. How do we get to the underground garage? I wish I could sprint or something, you know? It's a foggy night. Entrance. Greeville parking. Greeville. Enter with or by cred or by card at all times or see agent. I can't read now. I still moved, you know, <laughs> by that little. It was not a cutscene because I don't know what to call it then. By that moment with the ghost child. Need to find my car. Right click to call call your car. Getting closer. It's over here somewhere. There we are. Is this a Honda? Something? Though it's easy if you can remember the password. The ropes. Hello? Hey cuz, good job yesterday. Customers were happy and we made some money. Thank you. It's not as good as it used to be, though, with all the stories about the family. Business isn't booming, to say the least. All these ghost stories, and now the story with this guy that worked your shift. He said that he started seeing the ghosts following him home at night, like they were not happy he worked at the pizzeria. He was telling customers about it. Talk about bad publicity. Anyway, today you'll have to make some dough as we're running low. All publicity is good publicity, right? Already. Everything is in the kitchen. If you somehow forgot the recipe, it's on the computer. The password for the file is the year the pizzeria opened for the first time. I'm not going to give you a history lesson, as you should know, but I'm a nice guy. I'll give you a clue. Check the storage room. Good luck. Check the storage room. What's gonna happen in the storage room? I should find the password for the recipe on the computer. Where's the storage room? Is that... Is that in here? But I don't see shit in here. Nineteen seventy, right? Nineteen seventy nine, maybe? 1970 or 1979. It's when the pizza reopened. Um, 1970? Yeah. Falcostow. Family secret recipe. Important disclosure. If you do not belong to the Falcos family, please destroy this document immediately failing to comply will bring upon you all the wrath of our family we will sue you we will track you and if you don't lose everything you ever cherished by then we will end you <laughs> all right then okay i'll take a a picture of the recipe so i don't have to run back and watch it every time. I am terrible at remembering, you know. 
got it. And we will do the same for the menu. The pizza menu. Take a picture. Awesome. Okay. Let's make some dough. Huh. Gotta make some dough. So we can make some dough. Hey. Okay, 200 milliliters of pizza, uh, of water, I have to put in here. Um. What do we use to extract the water? I don't know. Okay, water. Why do they have water in a bin? You know <laughs> what? How do we know if there's enough? Ah, there it is. And we need it. How much? Two hundred milliliters of water. There we are. And then. 1000 grams of Falco's flour. Also called one kilo. There we go. 20 milligram of yeast. There we go. 10 gram salt. There we go. And 50 milliliters of oil. There we go. Let's make some dough. This is how we cut the dough into pieces. This is my last resort. Sorry. Need to cut the dough. Yeah. There we go. I take it to the counter now next to the register. Yay, we made dough ourselves today. And we have an order for a stagioni. Okay, let's make a stagioni. Hey, we need to get the oven heated up. What goes into a stagioni? We need tomato sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni. Tomato sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni, mushroom, and ham. There we go. Just put it in here. Oh, is it? Is it warm enough? Too cold? Check it out. Uh, we have temperature gun here. Oh, that's fine. And more orders coming in. A Capricciosa and a Linda. I did that. Tomato sauce. Onion and mushroom. All right. Another one. Okay, you can only make one at a time there. Fair enough. And 
this was the Linda. I can only make one at a time. That sucks. Is it still warm enough? It is. And pizza is done. Alrighty then. Hey. Put this one in the oven. Turn on the timer. And make the capricciosa. Use tomatoes, tomato sauce, mozzarella, ham and mushroom. There we go. And the heat. Oi. It's good. Between 400 and 460, right? Now ghosts in here. Awesome. It's gonna be a peaceful night. Maybe. Let's put one log in here. Keep it nice and warm. I can close my eyes <laughs> if I press E. Ready. Okay. One more pizza ready. we go awesome stuff oh that was the shadow from the mixer I thought someone was walking in here luckily that was not the case Not a lot going on in here today, tonight. That's fine by me. Nothing weird going on. Third pizza is done. Now I'm getting hungry. Okay, let's wait for the delivery guy. With his chainsaw. Here you go. Hey, your helmet. He won't listen to me. Sounds like a wine bottle broke. It did sound like a wine bottle broke. Go to the restroom and grab the mop. Let's do that. Stuff is going on. Let's clean it. Why can I clean it? I have to take. Okay, I did clean it. That was pretty easy. Yeah. Hello? Who's calling in the middle of the night? Hello? I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Hello? Turn on the breaker. Oh, shit. What? What happened? 
How did we end up in here? What's going on? Have you ever wondered why there is nobody to be seen in the restaurant at night? Excluding you, I mean. The Falcos wouldn't step in the place at night. Did you notice how even the delivery guy wouldn't cross the door? They actually crafted the delivery window five years ago when Vince, the younger Falco kid, was still doing some deliveries himself. They are conscious of the wrongs passed down through their family's history and mindful of their own personal mistakes. I know who your father is. The fact you are working there is surprising to me. You may not have the name, but you do have the blood. Why did you come back? What do you seek? Are we friends or enemies? I guess we shall find out soon enough. By the way, did you start dreaming yet? Yeah. I call them dreams, but they're more than that. I do believe that dying there would kill you here. A word of advice when you're walking in these dark corridors. Try to stay in the light. We'll talk more tomorrow. I'm preparing something for you. Something that may help you get the answers you seek, or simply bring more questions. Okay. Wow, what a game. I love this game. It's pretty, pretty, pretty awesome. Don't you think? If you like the video, please consider leaving a like and subscribe. Until next time, bye-bye. And thank you for watching, of course.